In this video, I'm going to show you the easy way to import multiple URLs into your WordPress sitemap. Welcome to All-in-One SEO. We make SEO easy with our powerful WordPress SEO plugin. Let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is install the All-in-One SEO plugin. If you already have AIO SEO installed, you can skip ahead to the next part of the video using the timestamps below. So let's go ahead and click on Plugins, and then click on the button that says Add New. If you haven't done so already, we're going to want to download the plugin from AIOSEO.com. You're going to go to the Account section into your Download area and click the big green button that says Download AIO SEO. And if you don't have an account already, you should be able to create one pretty easily. So back on the Plugins page of your WordPress website, we're going to go ahead and click the Upload Plugin button and then click Choose File and choose the plugin file that you just downloaded. and then click the Install Now button. After the plugin installs, click the blue button that says Activate Plugin. After the plugin installs and is activated, the AIO SEO Setup Wizard will pop up automatically. We have another video that walks you through these steps, and I highly encourage you to go through that wizard because it will just set up your whole website for success as far as your SEO efforts go. But for now, we're going to head back to the dashboard. And then if you scroll on down this page, there's a spot for us to enter our All-in-One SEO Pro license key. Back on our AIO SEO account, which you can find at AIOSEO.com slash account, make sure you're on the Downloads tab. And then next to where it says License Key, if you click on the icon, it will copy out our All-in-One SEO Pro license key. And then we're going to paste the license key into the License Key field. Click Connect. And that's it. All-in-One SEO Pro is activated on this website. If you want to be doubly sure, you can go ahead and click the blue Save Changes button. And then we're going to scroll up and click on the Dashboard link, just so we're all on the same page. Today, I'm going to show you how to add multiple URLs to your sitemap all at once using the All-in-One SEO plugin. Now, you might be wondering why do you want to add multiple URLs to your sitemap, especially when All-in-One SEO automatically generates a WordPress sitemap for you anyway. Well, you may have pages living outside of your WordPress installation. So for example, on this website that I use for demo purposes called AIO SEO Demo, there's a category here called Finance. And all of these articles live on this WordPress website. So if I pull up one of them, it's an article about debt relief that lives on this WordPress website and has the header and footer of the WordPress website attached to it. But we may also have different landing pages that live outside of WordPress. For example, we could have a landing page like this. This is linked to from a YouTube video or social media, something on Instagram. So we want this page to exist, but it's not part of the WordPress website. It doesn't have the header and footer and all of the navigation. So that's what this video is about today, including pages that live outside of your WordPress installation in your sitemap so they get indexed by Google and the other search engines. So from the WordPress dashboard, head on over to the all-in-one SEO menu and click on sitemaps. Make sure you're on the general sitemap tab up top. And then we're going to scroll down to where it says additional pages. Make sure this is toggled on. And then the first field you see here is where you can input pages one by one. That's not what we're interested in today, but that's where you can do that. What we're going to do is click this gray button here that says Import from CSV. If you're concerned that you might not have the right format for the upload file, you can actually download a sample CSV file here using this link. So since I already have this upload file created, I'm going to click the gray button that says Choose a File. I'm going to click the blue Import button. And then if we scroll down, we can see that my landing pages have been added. So in this example, I have a link that says the URL to my site, AIOSEO-demo.local slash Shopify slash sneakers sneaker2. So this could be a sneaker product that lives on my Shopify site that does not live in my WordPress site, but I want it to be included in my sitemap. Uh, same thing for sneaker one, sneakers, and then I have these three landing pages I've added. So that's how this is useful. All of the content that lives on your WordPress site is obviously already in your sitemap, but here we've added content from Shopify and a few landing pages. And it doesn't matter if you have five pages of content to add or 500 products from a store, 
You can do it all through this same simple process. Before you leave this page, make sure you scroll down to the bottom and hit the Save Changes button, and you're done. So that's how you import multiple URLs into your WordPress sitemap. If you click on this next video right here, I'll show you how to run an SEO analysis of your website. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks on how to use our easy and powerful SEO plugin, All-in-One SEO.